Okay, we just need to do a quick audio check just to make sure the audio is working because otherwise, why did I not have this set up? One day I will learn how to do this professionally and then I won't have to just hold on, quick audio check. Yep, audio check is working. There we go, done and dusted. Audio check is complete and everything is running A-OK -okay and smoothly. Oh. Right. Are we up? Let's have a look. Stream, condition, excellent. One concurrent viewer, one like. Huh. Yes, 100% so far. And hello, let's uh, well, yes, let's do this. We have to do a proper intro, don't we? Hold on, let's uh, zoom out. Let's go for that. Oh, wow, when you zoom out, it really, really shows just how much more we have done. Uh, I have improved the mic, I haven't had any comments that say the sound is lower, so I've turned the DB up, so that's all good. But anyway, this lovely beautiful city in front of me that you can see for the f on the far horizon is the county of Portsdale and it's created from the tiny little town of Badgerville which is like over here and it's expanded outwards into this massive massive city and you know what today we are going to be filling in this gap that's right here just full of houses we're going to try and get to a hundred and forty five thousand i think that's a little bit ambitious but you know it's a tuesday night and uh you know welcome to tuesday night nothing will happens on a tuesday i thought i'd plan this one today because you know thursday i've got a date with a with an actual human being i know miracles can happen but <laughs> let's crack on with today's episode and get stuck in there with filling in this gap which is right here maybe we'll come around here just really kind of blend this bit in and just you know and then next week we'll do Callum water your plants remember to water your plants when you watch this I hope your plants aren't dead but like because we took that hiatus but right now we're going to be working on filling the gap and yeah I know I planned uh, this to be on Wednesday tomorrow night but tomorrow night is quiz night which I actually forgot about to be which, sorry guys, but I need the human interaction. And that is my one weekly human interaction with other humans. Um, not that you're not humans, but you know, you're my online friends, to be fair. Uh, how are we going to do this? This is kind of interesting. I want to pull this back. But I also want to give them their own train line into our major network system. So let's go ahead and have a look at our options. And I think, well, we've got the basic train stop, but that would just be rather dull. So let's go have a look at this wonderful collection. Yeah, I think something like this would really fit in, tie into the area. Not a raised one, obviously, because that would just... Or maybe a raised one. Maybe it comes from the ground into a... Right now. Raised, raised. I was thinking the other day about raised trains, right? Now, a train line already takes up a square. And I suppose the benefit with having it raised is that you can get roads underneath it. So that, when we eventually build another big city over here or somewhere we are gonna i'm gonna treat this area actually as like a new game we're still gonna have portsydale and everything like that but we're gonna treat this like a new section that doesn't really connect to portsydale it's like its own thing its own area there'll be a way for trains to get in and stuff but it won't connect to this huge vast city down here
And so here we go. We're going to have to make a decision right now of how to handle this. And I feel we do need to smooth that out to a point. Because this looks a bit daft at the back here. And also, we should probably... I want to somehow connect this to that. So there's like an option before this roundabout for people to turn and come down or come off and around, just to you know, loosen things up. Oh dear, oh dear. We uh, we did have an streaming error. God damn. Why am I getting tech issues tonight? The mic didn't work before I got on. It's like it's like cursed today. Maybe Tuesdays are not the day. Maybe too many people in my area are watching Netflix tonight. So yeah, let's get rid of this train line. And let's just smooth this on out. See, I don't understand. Why is it perfect like one week? And then like for like many, many weeks. And then yeah, it's gone back to excellence. So that's wonderful. You see, that's the that's the thing with YouTube. You just gotta complain about the problem and then it goes away. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna bring this train line in. I don't really want it oh this is another thing as well, like how oh we've gotta have See, this is another thing when you like model cities and stuff, you gotta worry about like what's like underneath and how it's all gonna look in the end. Okay, so we're gonna have to push this train line a little bit further back. Okay, here we go. We've gone back to a healthy stream now. Wonderful. Just what is going on with this bit of land? I feel like just replacing these houses and starting again. Here we go, we're going to fill this slightly back in. I feel like we just undid all the good work there. But also, who says this road can't move a little bit further over? Because then that would like give us much more room. Yes, let's do that. Let's absolutely do that. Let's. let's Fill the gap by making the gap a bit bigger so we can get more stuff in to decorate it. Okay, in true fashion, gotta watch out for the trees as well. Actually, this is a cracking idea because this would actually make a lot of sense. Oh yeah, this was the floating highway idea that we had. So maybe if we just redirect it, going straight on. And then eventually making its way round. Oh my god, that's such a big gap difference to fill in. But we can absolutely do this. We can smash it, smash it right out of the park.
Okay, so this is going to be the area we're working with. That actually looks much better now we've pushed it out. Looks like definitely much more like a like a normal road over here in the UK. So let's push this back a little. Or should we just have this up? It's like an intermediate level. Ah, then we've got the train line. We've got to bring that in. So, yeah, let's think about that and bring the train line in along here. Okay. It's going to be... Oh, wrong way. There we go. See how that looks. Hold on. Let's give it a whirl. Ah, give me two seconds. God damn chest infection, sorry about that. It's just an absolute nightmare, it just crops up. It's not COVID at all, but oh, I'm probably gonna get banned for saying that word. Anyway, let's see if we can fit. Because this will look sick if we can just get it to go under this little point. It's not enough to make it look like a roller coaster, which is a good thing. Just to make it worth it, what we've got to do is to actually build a train station in this section as well. So this is the high-tech area, so it's going to have some kind of high-tech like station-looking thing, so I'm going to guess I'm not going to guess that. We're going to go for... Wow, well, we can't get it on an angle, or can we? Can we get it on an angle that suits? Oh, actually, is there like a combined? There's not really a combined, like, one for one. Because that would be good if you could have had one on top, one on the bottom. They went there. That would have been absolutely epic. But alas... No. But if we turned that road and a little bit way round, we could do this. And there, could we do this? No, it needs to be a little bit more. Too much. Okay, right. Well, we're going to choose a different station. Or are we, like... Maybe we should build this bit first, and then... Come on, come on. Nope. You know what? No, it's not going to work. So let's go with the classic. Thing. We are tr just trying to build the station back into it because we need to give this thing a bit of a purpose. See that? 
would look good. Do you reckon, ooh, could we get away with that though? Maybe we could actually get away with it with that that angle. Hold on, let's have a look. If we brought it back and then had that as the, the diversions there. I think we I think we've done it. We've cracked it. So here we go, and boom. Perfect. Bring that round. And then connect. Use the curve tool, as always, to get the best results. Come on. Oh, really? That's, that's how you're going to do it? OK. Is that going up and then down? Why? Okay, right. That's got to be... Is that just, just the way it looks? Nope. Perfect. Wonderful. So... Why can't we go straight off there? That's so strange. Okay, there we go. But why? That, this game is so weird sometimes. What it will and will not allow. So let's fill that in. You know, other side of the street, we're going to have the officers come in. And so we're going to be bringing up the train line as well. Pulling into here. Let's see. Should we use an ordinary? No, not an ordinary one. I can't remember the exact distance out, so we're going to have to tr uh, try almost first time. Perfect. And we are leaving a bit of room at the back there, just so we can smoothen the train line. And here we go, let's smooth this area out a bit. Oh. Okay, perfect. So we got a uh, train line, especially for our tech industry and Oh, God damn, one second. Give me two seconds. I am still getting over that damn infection. I'm sorry about that. Uh, but don't worry, I kept all the grossness off screen. So it just saves you. Saves you that. So don't worry. It's all good. I think I might come off early if it gets worse. I don't, don't know why this is suddenly happening. Okay, so let's fill in this area with more infrastructure and houses and things. Now, we did want a road that comes behind here because we can't really continue the train line into that. That would just be a little bit messy. 
And remember, we've got to save every tree we can. Because we are maxed out on all the trees. So I'm going to pop those over there. I'm going to move the park as well. Is that really sat in well? Is that? Can we move it up a little bit? There we go. Actually, it's a bit weird if it's not coming straight out at the beginning of the, the junction. It looks a bit off. So hold on, let's make this proper. Oh my god, it looks a bit of like a roller coaster ride down there. Give me two seconds to sort that out. There we go. I think round three is coming up. Just uh so I might have to disappear off camera in a second. God damn, it's been fine all day. And then as soon as you get just it's absolute Murphy's law, isn't it? <laughs> okay, right, so let's Oh, wow, that is a hill and a half. You can't build on that. So either we lower the whole thing, and then just have this as like a ridiculously steep hill. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Because that that's there's no way you could build like a little enclave or anything in between that. I mean, you could, but. Okay, so, ah, oh, yeah, that's a good point, actually. That's because of the train line there. That's why we did it. Will you put it back? Yes. Okay. That was cheating, I know. I know that was cheating. Technically. Okay, let's fix that back up again. Okay, so right. This is going to be an absolute challenge. If we look at the curvature, that's just a little bit too off. Going to be building buildings on it. But, you know, we like a challenge. And so what we're going to do is we're going to try and keep this as free and airy as we can. So first of all, let's build a way up to their new train station. And we did say we we're going to connect this road up as well. So I kind of want this sliding past if we can. Watch out for all the trees. And coming in a bit like that. Is that... Yeah, we will bring that, brush that back, put that back in. Oh my god, why, why are you not allowed to suddenly... That is very weird from both of them. Okay, fine, you can be your own little dead end. How about that? So I'm going to bring this down. We're going to turn it, and boom. Oh, yeah.
Okay, so let's see. Let's just put those in for now. If we've got water, we've got water, power. Yeah, power will jump straight across. Everything will be absolutely fine on that front. So we are trying to get to quite a lot of people living over here. So let's actually scale this back a little bit. Let's bring in high infrastructure. Ah, oh, god damn, I was gonna try and sneak off, but nope, the the viewers came back. Um we've gotta have a way up. So have a way up here. Now this is gonna probably look very horrible when it comes in. It's a very high possibility of that happening. I think I'm gonna have some generic offices, maybe. Like, just to give it a little break. <laughs> and then have a little side road that we can have a path go all the way down. God damn it. Uh, give me two secs. Cinematic mode, turn that off. I cannot catch a break today. Sorry about this, viewers. Like, it just keeps coming back. Anyway, right, let's get out of that. So, right, pathway coming back. Coming back, we were going to do a pathway straight down. Connect these guys up. Boom, done. Okay, obviously we've got a new train line, we need to bring in a new train. Boom. Boom, connects them up to the place where they work. And... Ah, it's got its own little station, nice. Pow. And then comes back. And then that's gonna bring in all the talent from across the cities and everything. So here we go, we have to bring in this as a borough as well. So we need to bring in some, oh, this is gonna go probably very horribly wrong. Although we are needing more housing and that's all gone in. And you can see the height disparity as well. That's going in there. So that's what we've got to also bear in mind. There you go, first train is running. Maybe have a few, maybe one corner apartment. And then the rest I'm going to keep so we can slope that down. Definitely another one there. And let's have a look. Let's bring this in. A little bit more. I'm going to brush that out. I feel like that needs to be brushed out a bit more. Let's go bring that in, bring that in. We're trying to get to 1,004, uh, 145,000 people living here. So we're going to have to start bringing in some more people. Now, that's this needs to be brushed out a bit more. This is, that's not realistic. So let's push that a bit back. There we go. There you go, brush that out a bit more. Boom, and then, I don't think there's anything that we could actually bring in behind here. I think this is just gonna be like a nice 
the weird hill that is just behind these houses. And we're just going to flatten that out just to make that a bit better on the old eyes. So there we go. Brought it in. How do you not have... Okay, fine. No, actually, you can, you can stay there. We will bring in a business, especially just to bring the power over. Although the power's not coming over from here. Okay, right, cool. We will bring a business up here. How about that? There's always a business willing to go right next to a park just for the monies. <laughs> Oh, sorry about that. That's grim. Well, at least the mic's turned up, so you can you can hear it properly now. And let's see. Should we have? Sh can we ca can we start a little mini? Enclave like this up here. Why the hell not? Let's try and do a little bit of something up here. No one cares. And smush this out a bit. Wonderful. Push that back. Because there's always like a little random block of flats in some places. So maybe if we come across here and out like that way, then we can bring in like a little estate up the top, consisting of like a few tower blocks. And then we just got to brush this bottom bit out. Is that too much? Too little? Right, it's done. It's done. Right, power is still not jumped over. What? Obviously, these guys are going to need a corner shop or two. Okay, two secs. Hold on. What is happening tonight? Sorry, absolutely sorry about that. Might have to cancel this live stream early. It seemed to have got rid of the infection, but picked up the sniffles. And so that's why this might have to be shut down. I'm going to give it another half an hour and see if it continues like this, because I don't want to keep interrupting the stream. Okay, so we got that in. Gonna need to try and make this look a bit better. Nope, not what I need. Or should we just make that just flat? Boom. And then r put rocks? No, that's an incredibly silly idea. But maybe two stage. Maybe something too stagey and then having just something in between there and then having a path come through. 
because we could thin this bit out. Hear me up. Hold on. So we're going to have a path come through. What about bike path? I'm mean, not really into bikes. But yeah, let's have a path come through. That would then lead to there. And now let's try our best to smooth it out. I love how these things are just, they just kick it to the side. The when they come speeding in, it almost looks like it derails. Can we push that out a bit more? Yeah, hold on, there we go. Can we push this back a bit? Yes, there we go. Because a little bit more texture, but now we'll, what do we do with the path? We'll bring it down and around here. Who's this going to help? I don't actually know. Uh, and that is probably the worst pass pl uh, place to put a path. What about up? Can we go up? Straight over and down. Okay. Oh god, that looks horrible. So we definitely can't go down. No, because there's too many too many lines on the ground. Can we? Nope. 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 So we're going to have to go above. There we go, and we're going to move that back just a little. I mean, I don't know who that's going to help. It doesn't actually look nice anyway. I don't know what I'm thinking. I think I'm panicking right now. I think maybe if we had it come down. And let's destroy one of these businesses. Just this little tiny one. Then we can be kind of justified. Dear sir or madam, we are destroying your business to put in a path because it will look more pleasantly pleasing if we can put it behind your shop don't think that would go down very well but there we go that looks better I would respect that <laughs> and obviously let's put dirt path in behind here, just so we can try and get a bit of traffic, a bit of life coming through. What mods do I use? Uh, hold on. Not many, to be honest. Uh, let's have a look. Just these ones. So the one that makes them all work together, empty it because you don't really want to be Dealing with that on a live stream. El Presidente, generally move it mod is kind of a good one. And then the extra landscaping tools really aren't that big of a big, big of a thing. And also we've opened up to 25 squares. Okay, so lots of foot traffic coming through down there. <coughs> 
And you got to remember, sorry, I am coming out of a nasty chest infection. Which is why my voice is a little bit messed up. There we go. Nice little cut through for them. And what if they were going... You know, if you got off the train, would you walk all that way around? I don't think you would. I think you'd do a desire line. And you would just beeline it. There we go, nice. <laughs> Not a single soul is using this pathway at the moment. Uh, no, that comes with the pack. Where is it? The train expansion pack. It's right here. So they all, the new ones all come with, I don't know, if I just lay them out for you. <coughs> Sorry about the cough. Uh, yeah, the new ones all come with like a little uh, parking like bay within them. This is like the like new added content. I don't actually use the parking lot mod. I don't know why. I get it would make uh, the city more realistic. I do would prefer it, but I don't know which one. Which one is it called? That parking lot one. I think I'm having inner city train. I don't want inner city trains coming through here. Absolutely turn that off. Okay, apparently we can't turn that off. Well, that is rather unfortunate. Okay, so we filled the gap through there. We filled it through here. Let's have it a bit more blendy. Oh no, people are using it. I take that back. People are using it. And let's put in a couple of shops along here. Just to bring a bit more foot traffic through this area. And obviously bring a cheeky path up to the estate as well. So it can always bring more people in and out, which would be good. Okay, then it's tree time. Just bring in some more large trees. Definitely, if you're hiding something like this, you want to bring in a big willow trees along here. They do a very decent tr job of like covering up stuff. That's way too many together. So yeah, that was so many close big trees that it was just a bit ridiculous. So we're just gonna shift some of these to other places. But yeah, it's always a good idea to try and cover up. <laughs> mm. 
Yeah, I've been a bit resistant to getting the parking one, if I'm completely honest. And this is kind of a tree area, so we don't mind bringing a bit more trees. Like through. Yeah, it's a bit weird how there's not so many trees out here. So let's bring a few more trees through. Perfect. And then obviously spill over from the park. Okay, there should definitely be a way of connecting these two roads up. Oh, nice and easy. Straight shot there. Straight shooting, as long as we can get it on target. Straight shooting. Oh, very sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Give me two secs. Honest to God, I did not know where this came from. Like, it literally, as soon as I turned on the camera, I got hit with this, like... Uh, oh, okay. Right, I'm going to take a screenshot of that and note that down. I did not know about that. Thank you very much. The more I know, I could go get it now, but I'm going to wait until after the stream and I will go get that. Thank you very much. That is very, very useful, Chris. Yeah. Yeah, let's bring a few more trees in. Bring the old favorites in. Let's bring in a few businesses along the road. Being careful about the trees, because we ma I, I maxed out the trees the other week. <laughs> Whoops. Got a little bit too carried away. There we go. It's an inter it's an inter like it's a junction area. There's not going to be much human interaction, so we can just fill these a bit more. Maybe bring in one or two. Do you think that will jump? I think it will jump. Maybe if we bring one along there. Okay, so we fleshed out this bit. We're going to tick that off. We're going to move down here. We've got a lot of demand for houses at the moment, so we should be thinking about bringing someone in. You know what? There's a lot of business and commercial over here, but there isn't any residential coming through. So let's have a road that comes off. Lovely 90 degree angle. Pull it back just a little. Can we do the tiniest curve? 
We could do the tiniest curve. Nice. Bring that back. Let's have a little... You know, there's people that really love to li like work. Work? Live close to work. That's what these people are. They, they're those kinds. Should we have it connect? That'll be a... Uh, because there's only one road off. There's actually two. We should really have that connect. Honestly, my luck at the moment. Is it too late to buy a Euro Millions? Okay, there we go. That's nice, smooth, that's down. Absolutely, why are people stopping? And let's bring this a bit further in. Let's have some dead ends. Oh, that didn't really create... This road's not going to be very busy either, so we could just kept plow on through if we wanted. I don't think either of these roads will be particularly busy. So what zone are these guys? Oh, they're not in a zone. Okay. These guys have no zone either. Let's give them their own zone. It's going to be like the original housing estate for them. And are we going to include this in the tech center? Though, oh, no, this could be its own little county, the little fill the gap county. What was going to go here? Sunset district. Oh, it's just a district. Okay. Boom. Oh, that's right. We wanted to expand this county down as well. If we could. But do we put the county at the bottom or the top? If I remember, oh, is it? It's not actually that hilly, is it? Okay, save the trees. Mm. How close do we want to be to that road network? No, we don't want to be too close because of the noise factor. So if we look at the noise factor, could bring it down to here. So what we could do is just take some of these, move them over, and while we're redesigning this area, hold on, if we just select trees only, oh, we'll go for this one. Whoop. Yeah, we're going to try and mark out this area where we're going to try and bring them into. Oh, look, you can find the hidden trees. Oh, okay, that's a good thing to know. That'd be a good uh, session clear up. Just go around like that and just pick up any... Trees that have been misplaced. Aha, that found some. Although that would be very boring for a live stream. So, 
let's expand out this area a bit, shall we? So filling in this gap, we're going to fill in this area a bit more. This is where I find out it's completely not level in the slightest. Oh no, not bad. That's also a good point. Yeah, the bar yeah, I should put barriers down to be honest. Ah, oh, yeah, we we're, we're now discovering why, but I tell you what, we will try and blend this in. I'm going to try and blend in this whole area. This is where I go back and I like regret doing anything to this area. Okay, so they've got their inroad right there. Uh, I'm very sorry, this business, but I will give you a free business elsewhere, I swear. Okay, let's that section over there is so curvy that why don't we have something that's a bit more straight laced down this section? Then it looks a bit. Oh, where do we go? It has to be into the junction. Can't not be. Oh, unless it's just like a dead end. Actually, quite quite liking that. Just this like nice little quiet dead end. What we're gonna do is we're gonna move this back just a little bit. Just gonna fire this off to there to there. <laughs> yeah, that that is a true point actually. We we could landscape to our heart's content. And just keep spending that money. What are we need? We need people's homes. Let's cut that for a pathway. Same thing there. Just in case we want to make like a pathway down and over. That'd be quite sick actually. Connecting those two up. Natural pathway down the middle. Damn it. God damn it. Give me two seconds. I'm very sorry. Hold on. Enjoy the cinematics while I just go do something very. I literally don't know where this has come from. Absolutely disgusting. Okay, let's lay down. Right, we have a goal. Let's try and achieve that goal by 10 o'clock. Because then it's off to bed. So these people are probably going to need services, but... Oh, wait, hold on. Before we bring those in, let's bring that forth. Oh, how do we, how do we proceed along here? So if we go back a bit, then we can come up against that. We can get the most bucks in and then do that perfect not that that's what I'm wangling for but that is now the most cost efficient way and let's bring in some houses down the back here 
few shops there and why was that business never connected? It's about to say, do you think we can get a pathway through? But nope. It came and built a house on it. He's like, oh, I don't suffer from uh, hay fever. Strangely, I um, had a really nice like throat infection cough thing. And now all of a sudden I have a runny nose for no reason. Like, honestly, it's not been like anything all day. A minute I jump on the live stream, suddenly I'm like, oh. What is, oh, no, damn it. So it's absolutely bizarre. And actually, I want to back way through. So I'm going to cancel that. <laughs> my, my city's just so beautiful, it makes me weep with um, tears and such. Okay, pathway's going in. Come on, let me let me sneak a pathway. Ah. Oh. No, we can get we can get a pathway along here, hold on. Hmm. Just trying to see no, just trying to wangle a path through. I think that'll be all right. Nope. Oh, come on. That is definitely big enough. Ah. Exactly what didn't want to happen. Happen. Oh yes, we got it. We got it. We got it. We got a path in. just so bizarre like yeah, it's just just randomly just started up like I'm not allergic to like anything any known substance apart from mean people very very allergic to mean people but aren't we all oh that went in Give me everything back, because I want to fix that path. Come on. Th there we go. Perfect. And let's sneak a path behind as well. Oh. There we go. Ah, oh, managed to do it without snapping any houses. Great. And just just a little cheat. Just a little sneaky sneaky cheat. This thing is absolutely ruthless. Okay, right, done, done. No, I feel. Let's just have a look. Fire. They all feel a bit left out. Fine, you can have your own fire department, which is a bit ridiculous. But there we go. Police, you're okay for that. Well, you get, it's not going to be good for education anyway, to be fair. You want your own clinic? It's like a hospital. There's a hospital right there. Okay. You know what? We're going to come back in a couple... No one's going to die immediately in a fire. So, because there's a fire station now in between the block. 
let's try and smooth this out as best we can. So let's push this out and then we're going to come back and try and smooth it out. To the point where hopefully it won't be that noticeable. Nope. Make it bigger. Nope. Control Z. Oh. So what we want is just have it just not noticeable enough. See, that's a little bit too noticeable. Just like what's running down my nose at the moment. One second. Oh my days, what is happening? You know what's going to be the ironic thing? Is that as soon as I get off the live stream, it will just stop. And it was just it's going to be Murphy's Law that it's just going to be like, Ha ha, you thought you were going to have a good day, and then this happened. But no, no, it's okay. It's not the worst thing. Okay, so that, I feel like that's kind of smooth enough. Whereabouts are you? Because obviously I, I don't know where. Whereabouts do you hail from? Oh no, that's not what we needed. And there we go. Push that back. Ah, oh, Cambridge. Nice. I've been to Cambridge once or twice in my life. I do like it up there. It's very nice. Paddle boats. But the, not the paddle boats. The, the original paddle boating. Bo boarding. Uh, what's it called? Punt, uh, punting. Got to say that word carefully. Um. <laughs> uh, yep, that's done. I think that's a bit all smoothed in. Something just happened, something smiley. We've only got a thousand to go before we hit target. We've still got this little gap to go as well. Still, a lot of people want to move into the city. Nice. So we've got this road that can come off as well. Do you think something terrible would happen if we connected this road to that. I think it would, but I kind of want to see what would happen. I kind of got to see it now, I've, I've spoken about it. Move a line of trees out of the way. I've got to be careful with my trees because I've used, I've gone up to the count of uh, how many trees I'm allowed. Let's also move the fire. Ex Let's move the the come on the fire station. Move it. I kind of need to see what would happen if this was a real thing. If we could, what happens if we connect this up? I know it's going to be a bad idea. No good will come of this. And obviously, don't want it connecting straight to the train station. And there we go. We can move you back 
just very gently behind there. There we go. No one noticed. There we go. These, these sections are now connected. So instead of having to go through the bottom here, through the bottom here, you could just come down this little side alley, which someone was already doing. Though you have to wait for the trains. But that does mean that's a new vent for some vehicles to come through instead of having to take our brain breaker junction. So that's good on that front. Fair. Fair, I will give you that. Yeah, is there? A, there's no cathedral. That is weird to think about because it should have a cathedral. It feels like it should have a cathedral. It feels like both of them should. I think even Guildford has a cathedral. I might be wrong. Don't don't judge me. Okay, so where are we at? Right. People are using this. Is it going to get mega busy? That is my question. Have I just opened a Pandora's box? Maybe. But we'll find out later. So let's go ahead and cut in here. Let's just really breathe through the outline this. 900 away from target. Okay, I'm just trying to bring a bit of variety and spice into the city. So by just doing something whimsical like that. Although, what we really want is just something where it just stops. Like that. Oh my god, one second. I have obviously angered the gods by streaming on a different night. They they are just like, no, how dare you do this? We were expecting streams only on a on a Thursday. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna keep that and just have it as a path, like a naturally placed path. Like I can't be fast. All the time, if something's a little bit out of whack. Okay, let's bring. Do you think I could fit? No, you can't. But we should. So if we just press pause for one second. Yeah, no, it's not. It's not going to allow us, is it? It's definitely not going to allow us do that without moving that pillar okay let's do this so we want it to be able to connect through this is like one of those roads that runs along the side of a busy road it doesn't actually touch there you go got that option now we need to bring in the exact road 
back in. Hold on, very intense moment. Boom. Hopefully that doesn't look too... Oh, that looks horrible. Back it up just a little bit. Perfect. Oh, that's, that's annoying. Oh yeah, I, I, I've seen that one before. Okay, are we actually gonna... Oh, happy accident, love it. Okay, great, yeah, no, I was totally meant to do that, 100. Absolutely, one hundred men do that. Yep, absolute pro here. You can you can tell by the charm and the wit. And there we go. We're going to bring in some stores along here now. How do we go about this? Is the question. It's a train line, so train lines aren't that noisy. Inherently, oh no, it is that noisy. Inherently, apparently. What if we got some trees? Just go copy. Okay, kind of reduce the sound barrier. Okay, but now we've marked the danger area with the trees. Well, it has pushed it back. Let's put more trees down. Put more trees down. Is it me or is it going lighter? I think it's going lighter. There we go. Just a nice, dense woodland behind here. Yeah, that's perfect. Yeah, it's perfect to lay a house on. So, this is going to be a guard that we can't go past. So, we are trying to get a little bit bang for buck. Not going to lie. I mean, like everyone uses everything differently, so it's, it's it, yeah, it's very good to see how. So I'm pretty sure, like no one uses anything in the world like the same way. I think I might have got a chest infection, and now I've got like a completely new bug. That would be that would be my luck right there. Okay, right. So how are we gonna do a state number two? This zoning, yeah, perfect. Perfect, absolutely free for all. <laughs> we want something that looks quite interesting from the air as well. Not just something that's gonna. Well, I'm actually quite liking that little curve. Let's go back a bit. Hold on. Stop there. Right, perfect. Oh, electricity, yes, that might be helpful. Best way to get some of that over there is probably via these. So, stack up them houses, 800 to target, which is gonna be absolutely demolished. Let's do that and that, and that's going to be a path through there. 
zigzag path. Cool. Um, let's have a row of three, actually, just so we can get, you know, a bit more. We can have a bit more design this way. I am so sorry about the sniffles. Just they just came, literally came out of the blue. Like honestly, if I knew it was going to be like this, would have probably cancelled. Obviously can't cancel because I've got that date on, on my regular day that I stream. Yes, yeah, a date with a real human. I know, I know. Get the jokes in now. Yep, she is blind, deaf and dumb. No, she's not. She's actually brilliant. Okay, let's bring uh, just some spacing just between them. Let's make that a different height. Just to give it a bit more of a vibe. Okay, are we on three? Why are we not on three speed? And we're going to block that off so we can get some kind of steps that come through. I'm just going to move these trees back just a little bit. Just so they're a bit more in line. And that we don't lose any. Okay, let's build like some just some random offices. <coughs> oh, we need some wherever there's offices and people, there needs to be quite a lot of shops so that would be a good thing do you reckon we just sneak some high density retail at the back here let's just sneak it on let's just sneak it sneaky sneaky there I mean no one's going to be around here oh, these like little enclaves are they I'm definitely going to need services and things, so we should be building that into our plan, but I'm not. Which is not a great idea. Maybe on the other side of the very busy road could be all the services. How is our bad idea road? Not bad. Quite busy. There's people using it. At the same time, could be very worse. Oh my lord, look at the tech. The tech industry does not... None of it looks fireproof. Fire is a mess in this game. Like, honestly, for Cities 2, there needs to be a fire patch. What, what is a... Budget for fire. We we'll boost that up to one hundred fifty percent. Now we go to fire. Okay, that's a bit more reasonable. But you know, we'll come back to that on like a different stream. We we'll have a look at what we can do and how much we can get away with, and readjust once the city's all mapped out. We can have a little look at how we can save some monies. Okay, how are we still 400 away from target? See, this is... I'm not really believing this. Like it's, just, it's just a bit too... <laughs> so I think here we're going to come out just a little bit like that. There we go, just so it sticks out and just breaks that 
line. That's fairly fine. We could do stuff like add a path to make your eye line a bit distracted. from that curvature. Oh my god, that went in straight, straight away, first time. Perfect. Oh, actually, mm, now. Mm, now is a bit more perfect. Wonderful. AT away from target. Sorry, this is turning into some dirty ASMR thing. Accidentally. Okay, wonderful, wonderful. That's all good, that's all good. Just need to fill in this gap, and then we filled in, I think, the thumbnail was just this, this bit. And then that whole gap is now filled in. All right, these guys don't have any educate. Okay, right, cool. We'll have to put down a school stuff for these guys. Yes! Winner! We've achieved the target for today. School on the train line. Hold on. In celebration, I'm going to go off and clear my nose. So, one second. Ah. Oh. We're live? Yes, we're live. Um, yes! Thank you for the encouragement, Chris. We got there. We got to 145,000 people. And the PC is holding up. I've got to say, rather impressed. I think on a con this has got to be sorted out. we got to fix this. This is probably going to be my next video of somehow making this a bit better. This tourist harbour. Maybe bringing it out this way and having two docks, at least. That's a good point. Oh, sh sugar, what's... Water? We've never struggled with water before. Okay. Uh, airport, you're a very good place to put pumps, to be honest. No one's going to question a bunch of pumps out here. So let's put two of you linking up like that get kind of close to the ships but we'll just ignore that okay sewage sewage is another where's it's like oh where's a good place where's a good place Oh, that's very close. What's the biggest facility we've got? Now, are these the best? 16,000 drain drainage capacity. 16, let's see, something has happened. 160,000. 60,000. 160,000, so it's the same. But these clean the sewage on the land. What's the difference between that and the eco one? I 
Apart from that, it uses more electricity. Let's go for it. That feels like something that could be... I'm trying to ha find somewhere that this would kind of fit in. Yeah, go on. That it would fit in right here. But maybe if we use the Move It mod just to prop that up so it doesn't look too ridiculous. There we go. Perfect. There you go, kind of blends in. Well, it will blend in when we come over here. Has that avoided a crisis? Just about. Wonderful. Kick that can down the road we have. So we've stabilised at 150k. 140, sorry, 145k. Demand is still good. Still raring to go. Oh shit, sorry. Should have warned you. We good to continue? I think we're good to continue. Okay. Nope. Okay, so might actually end this stream earlier than expected. I'd like to stream for like normally about two hours a day. Two hours a day, two hours a time. But I think because of this like fluey cold, I'm going to have to end it right here. Uh, we've achieved our target though. That's what I wanted to do. So we're not cutting you guys too short. But I just think it's a bit grim if I carry on any more past than the target so we are going to go into summary mode uh, yes thank you very much Chris so we're going to go into summary mode that's the wrong one this button it does look absolutely beautiful when you stand back and look at something so big and massive this is really annoying though so that's definitely the thing we've got to tackle. So yes, on this episode, we have filled the gap-ish. We still need a little bit done there. But we've had to retire early due to illness. And yes, we've got up to a population of 145,000. Everything's looking a bit epic. And I think on the next live stream, we will come to do Callum Water Your Plants, which is a district along here. And then maybe fill in this district as well to bring in more people into the centre of the city. <laughs> thank you very much for that comment. And thank you very much for letting me know about the train bug. I would definitely have to catch up and get that downloaded as straight away. But until then... I've been Badger the British, you've been watching me, and thank you for watching me. May you have a good evening. Thank you, Chris, for joining me and being a good sport and just being awesome. And I'm going to go and blow out my brains out in the bin, and uh, not not in that sense and fashion, with a tissue, obviously, because uh, it's coming back up again. Anyway, I've got to go, <laughs> so I will see you in a bit.